how to load ABR files into Painter, into Corel Painter. Now, I'm using the ABR format that's uh, Photoshop 2018, CC 2018. You can't actually load earlier ABR files, so that's a key thing to remember. Well, the first thing is to actually go to the brush tool. Once you select the brush tool and the painter tool, you just go over to the, yeah, on the right side, the little menu there on the brushes, and just go down and you've got import and new from Photoshop. Now, so a whole range of ABR files available for you using the ABR format. So just select that, just you can see there, CC file. You don't want the earlier formats. So early formats like Photoshop 6, really old Photoshop ABR format, just won't work. Once you've actually selected that, just go over there and just go click open. And I'm actually not going to do that because actually it takes quite a while to load. It really takes quite a long to import. It might be about a minute if you're talking about 150, 160 for different designs. Once you've actually selected the design, you can select the brush from that brush tool and you can use all the various features. Then you just go over here to the general and you can see captured there. So it's just captured. You can see the captured in there. And then you've got all the other options. You can select rake, etc. And as well as like plug-in, selection, etc etc you can see there a whole range of different options just about what you can apply the brushes obviously with the current document you can go and create new documents and so much more so just go and select one of those and once you've actually done that I'm going to use the selection option really like selection good thing about selection is that you can apply it and once you've done it create a selection for it very quick and easy create a nice selection and then you can apply effects and much more to that brush stroke so so you really great feature and certainly not one to to uh, ignore so once you've actually done that as so you can move that you see you've got a nice sort of textured sort of three-dimensional design and of course you've got a whole range of different brushes you can select you can use also various other options such as spacing and so on and so on and tweak them to a vast number of ways and of course you can then go and save them in the painter hope you found this of interest thank you much